Hi, this is Rian from Must Be Noob. In this lab guide, we will learn how to perform manual backup of a DHCP server using the DHCP management console in Windows Server 2019. By default, Windows will backup the DHCP database and configuration at every 60 minutes at this location, which is C colon slash Windows slash System32 slash DHCP. And under this location, we will have a one folder with the name backup. But it is not going to help you if your server crashes and you are unable to access the file system. That's why it is recommended to either change the location to a network share or other hard drive. For the purpose of this lab guide, I have attached one additional hard disk to our system. Let's see that. Let's right click on start button and open disk management. Here we have another disk, disk 1 and on that disk I have created one volume with the drive letter D. Let's open this volume. Here I am going to create a new folder. I am giving name dhcp-backup-labguide. Let's minimize this console and let's close disk management console as well. I am also going to minimize this console as well. To perform a manual backup of our DHCP server, let's open DHCP management console. For that, we need to click on start button, click on windows admin tools and double click on DHCP. On DHCP management console, expand and right click on your DHCP server name and here we have options for backup and restore. If you want to perform backup, that time you simply need to click on backup. But the location of which you can see here is the default one, which is C colon slash windows slash system32 slash DSCP slash backup. If you want to store this backup on a network share folder, then browse the path of that share folder. And if you want to specify a different location than the default one, then browse the path. But I'm not going to do that. Let's click on cancel. Why? Let me show that. Let's right click on our server name and select properties. Because the default location of backup path is mentioned here. If you want to store automatic backup of our DFCP server on different location, in that time you need to change this path. Let's go to File Explorer and I'm going to copy this path. Let's copy it and minimize it. And let's paste that path here. So now our backup path will be d colon slash dhcp hyphen backup hyphen lab guide, which is right now totally empty. Okay, let's minimize it. Click on apply and click on OK. Now whenever server will perform automatic backup of our dhcp server, that backup is going to store under that defined location. Suppose if you want to perform manual backup of your dhcp server, that time you need to right click on your server name and select backup. Now this time, that location which we have specified in the properties of our DHCP server is selected, which is D colon slash DHCP hyphen backup hyphen lab guide. Click on OK. That's it. Let's go to that location. And you can see we have a DHCP configuration and under new, we have a backup of our DHCP database and log files. Let's go back to DHCP management console. And suppose in future, if you want to restore the backup of your DHCP database, that time you just need to right click on your server and select restore. Select the location. In our case, it is D colon slash DHCP hyphen backup hyphen lab guide and click on OK. That is going to ask you in order to restore backup of DHCP server, it is going to restart our DHCP server. Would you like to do this now? If you want to restore the backup with DHCP service restart, click on yes. And if you don't want to restore, then simply click on no button. In this lab guide, we have seen the steps to perform manual backup of DHCP server on Windows Server 2019.